Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I truly appreciate you joining me. I hope everyone is having a great weekend. I have a collective haul. I have items from Dollar Tree, one item from Hobby Lobby and a D stash that I purchased. So I'm gonna start off with Dollar Tree. Uh, Jack picked up two packages of these uh, mini cups and you get 20 in a pack. So he got those. I picked up a composition uh, notebook. This one is really pretty. It has a marble effect with some foiling. So I got that, it's front and back. Picked up an eraser to kind of go along with that. Uh, it's by Jot and it's so cute, the smiley face. So got that. Uh, a while back, like several years ago, they came out with some dies and I purchased a bunch of them and I actually gave them all away and I didn't I didn't keep uh, a set for myself so as they've come out with uh, them again I've been able to get all of them and I think this is the last one I needed and uh, so yes this is a repeat and these are the three that you get in there so I think that I've actually uh, have them all now so and these do cut really really nice uh, got a pack of stickers. Uh, I just really like the coloring of these flowers. Really a pretty pale there by Crafter Square. So I got those. I got a couple more packs of stickers and these ones have more of a vintage feel to me. I'm currently working on a journal that someone ordered and they wanted it to be vintage style. So I've uh, been working on those and I saw these and uh, thought these might go well. So I'll use this to embellish the journal. And then this pack here. Now I might already have these in my stash, but I thought, well, pick them up. And if I do, well, I'll use them anyway. And then also for that vintage uh, style journal, I picked up this ribbon and I've used this before. I had a little bit in my stash, but I still needed some more because I'm going to use this uh, on the edges of my pockets and my tuck spots and stuff like that. And this one has nine feet and it's the off-white lace. And um, I've used this many times in other journals. I really, really like it. And I think for this vintage style journal, it's gonna go great. Usually when I am using ribbon uh, for a journal for the edges of pockets and tuck spots, I usually use a little over two rolls. So I bought me six of them because um, I'll use this, uh, uh, more than two of them up, and then I'll have some more for other future journal projects so that's what I got there and then I finally finally am starting to see the clear stamps it's taken uh, these Dollar Trees around here a long time uh, and I only found uh, I actually found five of them but someone had already gifted me one so I didn't get that one but these are the ones that I did pick up and I picked up a second set for uh, my BFF Camille. So I have this one with the alphabet. So I really like that and the numbers. So I got that pack. What a great deal. And then I got this one and I think that I'll be able to use this, some of these images in uh, the journal I'm working on. So I got that one. Uh, this one also looks like maybe I might be able to use this as well. So I got that. And then the last one uh, is the calendar and uh, uh, stuff like that. So pretty cool. Finally hit my Dollar Tree. A lot of people have been hauling these for quite a while. And, uh, and yet they didn't have very many of these. So I found Mia's set and I found Camille's set. And I know there's more of them out there, but these are the only ones that I found so far. All right, that's all I picked up from Dollar Tree from Hobby Lobby, one item. Uh, I wanted a cameo uh, because I wanna be able to put this on the cover. Now I'm gonna build it up and put uh, 
you know, layer it up and stuff like that. But this is the cameo I purchased for that vintage journal and it was 50% off. So yes, I hit it at the right time and uh, was able to get that. So that's going to work out really, really well. All right. I also uh, purchased a D stash and I purchased it from my sweet friend Rebecca and her channel is Rebecca Creates. So I was watching her channel and she had uh, a lot of uh, D stashes and I was uh, really interested in one of them because she had graphic 45 uh, paper pads and I looked at it and I'm like, no hesitation. Yes, I want to purchase it. And she sent it really, really quickly. I got it within a couple of days. So I'm going to pause the camera and pull out the um, a D stash purchase that I that I got. I purchased this D stash from my sweet friend Rebecca over at Rebecca Creates. I'm going to include her channel in the description box below. Go pay her a visit. Give her some love and support and let her know I sent you. Rebecca is so creative and talented, so uh, yeah, you'll enjoy her channel. All right, when she said that she had some Graphic 45 uh, on a D stash, and she had a lot of D stashes, I'm not sure if those are all sold or not, but uh, if you're interested, go check that out. Um, but when she said Graphic 45, I'm like, ooh, let me check this out. And uh, uh, when she was done showing everything, I'm like, yeah, I definitely want this. These are some chipboards and there it is there. Never been used. Here's another set of uh, chipboard. And then here are some stickers. Let's see which direction. Uh, I think I think they just go this way. And then here. And then here are some loose leaf uh, sheets that she included. And let's see this way. Isn't that adorable? I love that. And they are double sided. And then three sheets of this particular one here. And then the other side is this here. So just gorgeous, gorgeous uh, patterns. So I got three of those. Get that over there. All right, and then a sheet of stickers. And it looks like they are like alphabet stickers and, and stuff like that. So there's a set of stickers. And she was kind enough to put it in a little baggie because some of them were uh, trying to fall off. So pack of those. All right, let's get into the paper pads that came in this D stash. And I have my phone so I can read the name of the uh, collection. This one is called Enchanted Forest. So here is that one. And let's see if I can do a flip through. Now she did include in here if she uh cut a little bit off she left the off cuts in here and i'm like whoa okay that's kind of nice so here's the, this first one Let's see if i can flip through it so you guys can have somewhat of a idea of what it looks like and then here's the flip side because again it is double sided and you have cut aparts and stuff like that so really really cool so there's the first one, and these I believe are eight by eight. The second one is called, let's see if I can find it. It's called Midnight, uh, let's see, uh, Midnight Masquerade. Okay, let's see if she, I thought there was some off cuts in this one. Nope. Okay, so let me kind of do a flip through here. And again, it's double sided. So that one is that one. And then this next one is 
called uh, Voyage Beneath the Sea. Voyage Beneath the Sea. I know there's some off cuts on here. And again, <laughs> she included all of those. She doesn't waste anything, does she? So here is this paper pad. I'll put those off cuts back in because they can make tags out of those or, you know, anything. So that's a true crafter for you. All right, the next one is called, uh, let's see, uh, fairy dust, fairy's dust. Make sure there's not any little, oops, there are. There's some off cuts and she included those. Make sure, okay. Great, great um, paper pads for journal making is what I'm thinking, yep. And then she included a 12 by 12, and this one is called uh, Time to Celebrate. And I really did like this. Let me make sure there's not any off cuts that are gonna fall out. Oh. And that was a 12 by 12. And let's give it a go at a... Uh, flip through here. So really, really cool. So those are the paper pads that were included in this D stash and I'm really, really happy with it. Um, and really glad that I had clicked on and checked out her D stash and uh, very happy with her promptness. She was very, very quick about it. Then uh, I open the box and I see this baggie full of goodies and what she put on here, I'll show it to you. It says, um, extras, thank you. And this is way, way generous, very generous. I'm gonna pull all this stuff out and show you what she uh, <laughs> included. And I'm like, wow, this is so super sweet of her. Let me sort this all out. Uh, she included these, and I think they're like frames. Um, I'll show you those. Pack of those. Uh, some um, bags. Here's a bag. Isn't that cute? That cellophane bag, kind of. Here's some little charms. These are so cute. Some paper clips. These are really large paper clips. Um, love these for journal uh, to include other things in a journal. So got those. Let's see. Here is some itty bitty doilies. Those are cute. And it says it's Hello Kitty. How cool. <laughs> so I like those. Some more doilies. love that size those fit on a um, card front really really nicely so there's a bunch of those I think there's yeah there's a bunch of those I really like those uh, let's see just a bunch of those same doilies in different colors I think there's pink oh there's some there's lots of pinks and purple ones really nice pastels and then there's these foil ones. Love those. Love those. Uh, in fact, I'll keep those out on my craft table because, again, I'm working on this vintage journal. Uh, that is going to probably be included there. Um, let's see. Some more doilies. These ones are just slightly bigger. Um, let's see. And then these... 
three of those and keep going. I'm not sure what this was. Um, oh, I think they're little bags. Let me double check. Yeah, I think they're little. Oh, they're so cute. Little, little, uh, little bags. They're so cute. That's fun to um, add to journals too. So have a pack of those. Put those back in. Let's see, have those. Um, oh, these are pretty. Uh, four of these. Oh, yeah, four of these sacks. Uh, let's see. Sort this out a little bit. Here's some more of these sacks. Oh, there's some more of these. Oh, some in orange. Cool. Halloween time. And then there are these sacks. Pretty those are. Again, great to add to journals. You can just put it in like that, whether you're cinching it or just adding it to a signature. Perfect. And then this journal, uh, journal, have my mind on journals. This doily, I think there's only, I'm not sure if there's a couple in here or not. I'm going to pull it out and see. Ooh, they're substantial. They're really thick. I don't know if it's one. It feels like it's one. But it's not a paper doily. It's, you know, I'm not sure what it's made out of, but pretty cool. I love that. And then this is a square doily and there's several let me see yeah there's several i am definitely going to use these in the journal so yeah so i think there's two of them in here which is perfect so yeah i'll use those and then she uh included this tiny little envelope and some journaling cards super cool Let's see, this one says, you are awesome. You are awesome. So that's cute. This one with the hearts. And then on that side, this one with polka dots. And then that side. And then some large journaling cards. Uh, oh, I like that one. I love that one. There's the other side. And then here, hearts and then stripes. Diagonal stripes. Uh, another one. Oh no, it's not the same. Uh, this one here. And then these hearts. And then let me see if I can read this. Probably not. Uh, um, no. <laughs> and then this one here. Uh, if it's script, I have a hard time. Oh, Mr. and Mrs. All right. And then she also included, I think this is a pin, or it could be a little charm, dangle. That's cool, I like that. And if that weren't enough, she gave me some uh, wood mount stamps. I love wood mount stamps. So she included this one that says cheers love it love it and then this one let's see uh i like this and i might use this uh not might i probably will use this for the journal that i'm working on and then this one let's see i think it goes this direction really really cool so sweet so thoughtful and generous I really, really appreciated. Oh my gosh, this was an incredible uh, deal and I love it all. All right, uh, so that's the D stash that I purchased uh, from Rebecca and then all the extra goodies that she sent along. Wow, super sweet. All right, that is all I have for this collective haul. I really do appreciate you guys hanging out with me for just a bit. Till next time, be safe, be happy, be positive. And you guys rock.